It's Andrea Albright. So many people fail at losing weight because they're looking for that quick fix. But this way of thinking only sets you up to be victimized by all those diet pill scams and internet scams. The only way to lose weight long term and keep it off is to follow a healthy weight loss plan. And I'm going to give you some quick tips on how you can do that today. The first step in a healthy weight loss plan is to start feeding your body with healthy nutrition. A lot of those diet plans tell you all the foods that you should cut out and stop eating, but that only makes you feel deprived and like you're missing out on something. So the way that you should do this is to just start eating a lot of healthy food. This is gonna keep your body nourished and that's gonna eliminate most of the cravings you're having because cravings come when you're starving and when your body's not getting the nutrition that you need. Take this broccoli for example. How much of this broccoli do you think I'd have to eat in order to gain weight? Let's just agree that it would be impossible for me to eat enough of this broccoli to get fat. So don't think about how much food you're eating. Think about the quality of food that you're eating. So step number two to a healthy weight loss plan is to find activities that are fun for your body. If you've ever tried to stick to an exercise plan and weren't able to, and then you just thought, I don't have any willpower, I can't do it, maybe it wasn't your willpower. Maybe it was the exercises you were trying to do. The key is to find things that are fun for your body, activities and movements that feel good. Maybe you like team sports. Maybe you want to take a dance class. Maybe you want to try some yoga or some Pilates. There's so many ways to be active. It's about discovering what feels right and feels good to you and your body. For me, I love yoga. Ever since I first started doing yoga, it's changed my whole relationship with exercise. I used to hate it, and now it's something that I look forward to doing because my body loves it. So it's really about discovering what your body wants to do. It feels good, and when you love it, you're gonna wanna do it more often. See how that works? So the third step to a healthy weight loss plan is relaxation. When I tell people to relax who want to lose weight, they're thinking, what do you mean relax? Aren't I supposed to be working and sweating and pushing myself all the time? But this is one of the main reasons why you can't lose weight. If you're always pushing yourself and working hard, you're stressed out all the time. And when you're stressed out, you're releasing chemicals which are making you store fat and preventing you from losing weight. If you don't know how to relax, you should try visiting my website at andreaalbright.com. Go to a place inside of yourself that is peaceful, loving, and it's tranquil. This does amazing things, not only for your health in the moment, but it builds up your confidence and your love for yourself. Do you see how loving yourself can be an important part of a healthy weight loss plan? It's actually the most important part, because the more you give to yourself, the better you feel about who you are as a person, and it becomes easier to give yourself the good things that you know that you deserve. I believe in you. I know that you deserve the best that this life has to offer. I want you to have a healthy body, a peaceful mind, and a radiant spirit. You can have it. It's yours. It's all inside of you.